Are we ready? Oh my gosh, are we ready? We're doing it. Get into your space, move some things out of the way. Just move it a little bit. You're gonna plant your feet. I'm pretty sure this, the thing I'm wearing was a little boy's vest. And that's why the hood is really small. <laughs> with your breath. Inhale, deep. Exhale, long. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Good, both feet out. Plie. Stretch. Stretch, arms are slowly reaching up. Good, take them down. Four plies. Wide stance, your feet are parallel. Just relax, it's gonna be okay. Inner thighs are engaging a little bit. Every time you straighten the legs, you're feeling like you're a rocket ship. Four down. Now 
your tailbone and your sits bones diagonally backward as you're as you're twisting here. Notice how that just lengthens the stretch, deepens it, whatever it is. And release. Gorgeous. Then the left palm taking the right arm up, straightening through the right leg ever so slightly. Thinking about the tailbones, the sits bones behind you. Inhale, deep, look up. Exhale, mouth. Eight counts, roll it up. Um, how do I explain this? 
Like if your knees are going way past your toes here, widen it. Does that make sense? So if your hips are are tight and yours is small, that's I love this. Or your inner thighs, like this is tight. But if you're feeling like it's it's getting like <laughs> instable. Okay, we're going for stability. Everybody. There we go. Arms are going to second. We're finding this. We're taking your arms. High. Open. High. Open. High. Open. High. Open. Open. Relax the toes, spread them wider. Relax the rib cage down press. And then re engage the hamstring. Find your inner smile, whatever it is. Good. Two more sets make it beautiful. Good, let's take a side bend. Keep the knee cuffs engaged here. And up. Over to the other side. Up to the middle. Walk the feet parallel. Hands behind the head. Find length through the spine. Tailbone. Yeah. Take it over to the left. Bend through the knees, chin to chest. Up, over to the right. Open the chest a little bit. And keep the circle going. Left. Yeah. Slowly taking it up. Open the chest. Drop an emoji, how you're feeling. <laughs> My deck is alive! That sent me to another dimension! <laughs> Fuck with us, bitch. We're in other dimensions. Alright, we're gonna be in first position. We're gonna do some tondos. Happy! Oh no. <laughs> Exhausted but not in a human. 
Uh, we're all see, we're all having such vastly different experiences, and I love that we're all fucking honoring that about ourselves. Sometimes in a dance class that's in person, you have to be really like, what's the rest of the class feeling? Because I have to be on that page. You don't have to be on that page here, okay? So keep honoring it. Yes. We're in first. We're learning to tondu. Some of us for the first time. Okay. If that's you, you're doing a great job so far. Beautiful work. We're brushing through the floor. As we do this, whoa, some spooky shit just happened. I'm not playing around. A pillow that was fully sitting up just fully flopped over. No windows open. Okay, we're, we're brushing through. Tondoing front, pointing through the foot, and then we're closing, keeping the foot as on the ground as we can without sinking our, our hip bones. Okay, so we want to try and keep, put your hands, bend your knees, get in there. You can kind of calm your hip bones when you're bent and then stand up and be like, got it, they're right there. Now, when you tondu, just try and keep those level, yeah? And then notice how you have to, what is this like doing to make that happen? And then can you copy paste that sensation onto the other leg as you tondu front with the left leg, okay? Even if you know a tondu and you've already done a tondu, sometimes we just forget. How is it? I do every time. Every time I hit a tondu, I have to remind my body what I'm doing, remind my mind. And then all of a sudden, I'm like, there it is! That's a supportive tondu. Okay, and then the only thing that's a little different about that is that I want you to think about sending the pelvis a little more in so that you can find this extension from the top of the, the inner thigh forward along a diagonal. Okay? So keep it in the toes. Yes, grab your pants or whatever you have right here. Tondu, pull it forward woo, like a string and go with that energy. And then you see how you can lift the leg, like, you can really go. That's how you arabesque. You have to pull this forward. Ooh, there's that inner thigh. Lengthen. Go for it. You know what I mean? Okay. One. Two. Three. Lift. Crush. Crush. Slow.
last one. Up. Open. Lift. Swing, swing, close. Relax the arms. Side out. Take a deep breath in. Okay. Reprieve your, your turn out for one solid moment. Thank you if you're here. I have a tip link in my bio. Tips are what help me keep these classes going. So thank you to anyone who tips. I love you. We're gonna do some stuff to the side now. We just did front and a little back. All right. From first, let's take arms flower petals. The arms are super tired. I know. Mine are. That's just a mean thing. Ready? Sit. You got this. Following along with me. Fondue. Close first. Up the leg. Down the leg. Fondue. First. Up the leg. Down the leg. Fondue. Okay, yeah, Abby, I already said that. Aaron's here. Sydney's here. Thank you, everybody. Woo! Another Hannah. Woo! Woo! Okay. <laughs> we took a breath. Hips made of pop rocks. Um, gorgeous. Let's plant the palms together. And I literally mean plant them as if you were carefully planting a seed. We're gonna engage through the left leg, lift the right knee to the chest, open around and back, bend through the knee, bend through the knee, take it up, straighten through the standing leg, open, back, bend through the knee, and take it through, knee to chest. If you're falling over, of course, I love you, back, Pick a point in front of you. Forward. Open. Back. Bend. Last one. Up. Open. Over a fire hydrant. Pull up your center. Switch legs. Jeepers. Knee lift. Open. Back. I have to move forward. <laughs> Up. Open. Open. Gorgeous bend. Through. Hips. Empower you. 
plant the palms. Did you forget? I did. To the <laughs> bend through, sweep it up. Two more. Open. Back. Melt. Fondue. Lift. Settle the shoulders. Settle your face. Pull up through center. And melt it down. Release the palms. Did that take the crunch out at all? Sometimes it just needs to loosen up, but other times it's just a crunch is a crunch. That burns so good. I love everybody. Y'all are really killing it. Okay. Oh, my favorite artist, Sylvanasso. Okay, so marking 
kicking it out once to the back without the arms. Right leg, fondue, it goes off. I'm sorry, left leg fondue, right leg goes off the floor. Stretches as you come to the Buddha PA, close this first. I'm touching my heel. I'm touching my heel toward the back of my low calf. As we go higher, it would just come toe to the back of the knee. Yes? Arms. I feel like it might help us to do actually the opposite. Same, opposite, same. Same, opposite, same. I like that. This feels harder. I don't know why. Ready? Six. I already know, it's pelvis over toes. Pelvis over toes. Pelvis over toes, every time. Should we take it a little higher? Breathe. Send your femur out, open wide. Yes, it'll create your stability, open wide. Four 
more. Take it into the core, rib cage down. Last one. Finish. Hand on the heart, baby. Gorgeous. Cross right foot over left knee. You can hold on to something. But we're just gonna tip forward. Let me see if I can. And tip forward and send that booty back, just stretching out the hair. Don't force it. Switch. Breathing deep here, steadying breath. Notice where your thoughts are going. Yeah. 
pass out a little bit, do a little. Keep, um, it's a very small stretch. I never want you to take it to a crazy extreme. When you're stretching, when you're already warm and you keep and you still need that muscle, don't overstretch. Like in between bar and center. If you're one of my ballerina babes in a real class, this is a real class. Don't denounce myself. Stop doing that, Ava. <sighs> you just saw my inner bottle. I'm sorry about that. Don't do splits and stuff and just like sit in it. It's just bad for your muscles because they just got warm and you still need them to be like. <laughs> you get it. All right, let's do these arms. Okay. Woo! Chasse. Second. Take them up. Opposite. 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 Same thing we just did. Switching them three times. Open them out to second. Let's take them down to go. Second. Up. Opposite. 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 Second. Down. Second. Okay? To the other side. It's second. Up. Opposite. 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 Second. Down. They never stop. So if these get a little lost for you, Keep doing what we were doing that last time. Yeah, keep the keep the hands in the sweatpants pockets. What a vibe, you know. Okay. I do want to get to the fun part of the song. It gets very like boom, boom, boom. Right leg back. So let's start with the left leg front. Your shot saying right leg is coming to the front. Doing your best. Here we go. Five. Two steps. 
to the floor. Walk the feet together. Bend through the knees. See if you can come into a squat. Turning your feet out maybe. Or coming up onto your hands. Walk your fingers behind your legs and then come to a cross leg. Sitting up tall. Close your eyes here. Drop in. Notice 
Your time. That was called I by Ethan Gruska.
London. That's so lovely to hear. Thank you, Aspen. Thank you so much to my moderator. I really love and appreciate you. And I'm sending love and appreciation to everyone who came today and shared this space and your energy with me. I believe that it connects us in a way that we can't quite comprehend. Um, but I do know that it always leaves me with a different feeling than I entered with. And most often, it's for the positive. I don't have Cash App, I only have Venmo. But thank you for inquiring. Yay. Much love to everybody here, right? Thank you, Hannah. Thank you, Bryony. Thank you, Selena. Thank you, Liz. Thank you, long-haired butch. <laughs> Thank you, Sinister Tail. Abby. Oh, Deborah. Thank you, Deborah, for being here. Um, Jules, thank you so much. Ms. BB Dro. <laughs> thank you so much. MJ, thank you. Lou, thank you. Hannah, thank you. Both Hannahs. Little Flying Potato, ah, thank you. Wow. Sorry, I'm just screenshotting some of these comments because I'm just grateful. <laughs> I'm just grateful, so. <sighs> wow. I do these every single Sunday. Every single Sunday, 2.30 to 3.30 p.m. Eastern Time. Um, I also offer private lessons. So if anybody's interested, there is um, information in my bio. A little form you can fill out. Um, oh, these these are like, these are like really chill ballet. Um, these are really chill ballet, like, mm, contemporary ballet classes, let's say that. <laughs> I would call them, right? Maybe I should just start calling it contemporary ballet. Even though I'm very grounded in the technique of ballet, and I will, hopefully, hopefully I do a decent job at instructing you, especially if you're a beginner today. I hope that you're still alive. <laughs> Um, if you were a beginner today, you did a fucking great job, okay? Just keep saying that. No matter, no matter how you're even feeling right now, behind it all is, I did a great fucking job, <laughs> okay? All right, I love all of you. Thank you so much for being here, and I will see you next Sunday, okay? <laughs>